Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I show you around my room because I figured why not? I spend most of my weekend up here anyway. I decided to try these new prebiotics and they just didn't react well with me. I started reading the reviews a little bit more in depth and it looks like a few other people also had similar symptoms as me and I just stopped taking them. I even threw the freaking pills away but it was just not a good time. Luckily, I am good to go. So I just wanted to show you our room. Hopefully you find some inspiration. I will try to like link as many things that I possibly can down below. As long as I find them, it will be down below. All right, guys, let's go. All right, so this is a quick overview of our room. As you guys could tell, I don't like a lot of things going on. So we'll start off over here to my right. We have my husband's dresser. And I label every single drawer just so once in a blue moon that he has to put our clothes away or he has to fold our clothes and put it away. He knows exactly where it goes. On top of here, I thrifted this. And then we have a picture of my beautiful baby girl the first day that we bought her home. These baskets are from Ikea. And then this elephant is from TJ Maxx, I believe. And I heard that it's good luck if the elephant trunk is facing the door. That is my baby's room over there. So we have an elephant facing the door. Below, we have this basket that my friend gave us. And we just put all of our house shoes in here because it's like the perfect size. For this wall then moving on over here we have our air purifier we sleep with this on every single day and then we have our dresser if I didn't mention all of our furniture is from Ikea so I'll try to link everything that's available down below so the same thing here I labeled everything this is actually my dresser so that way when my husband has to put the clothes away he knows exactly where he goes we got this tray from Target, and in this tray we have our massage gun, the remote TV, the fan remote, and this candle from Aldi that I'm just trying to use up. And then, I don't know if this is weird to you guys, but it's not weird to me or my husband, but we have the ashes of our dog. We loved Mia Bella so much, and she completed our family, and when she passed, we were sad, but we knew that it was her time to go because she was a really old dog. Like, she lived for 14 years, and her approximate date or year was 13 years. But she was just such a good dog, and I feel like no other dog could compare to her. And we want to feel close to her, so we put her ashes there because we remember her every single day. And the reason why it's there is because this was her spot. Like, she was very loyal to my husband, and this is my husband's side, so it's only right for... Mia to be here and we feel her presence all the time like sometimes I hear her moaning and stuff so <laughs> yeah so these um mirrors are also from Ikea these are from my husband's back apartment days and I know that he wanted like a big mirror but it was cheaper to have two mirrors so these are also from Ikea and these are some pictures of my husband and I when we went out for New Year's for the first time without our without our family so pretty special in this corner it's an olive tree and I don't know where this is from I have to look it up and link it down below but literally in this corner I envision an olive tree I didn't envision anything else I wanted an olive tree and I'm so happy that I found it because this was under I think 150 bucks under that so I probably pay like 120 or something like that so this nice stand also from Ikea um my husband's underwear and his socks. This lamp is from Target. This basket's from Target and this charging dock, I don't know where it's from. But in these baskets, literally, it's nothing but junk. Like his contact solution, um, stuff from his Fitbit or his um, Apple Watch. Like, it's just a mess there. But mine's also a mess too. Then we have our bed also from Ikea. So the sheets are from the brand Casa Luna from the Target collection. Wait, what? Okay, 
It's from Target, the brand Casa Luna. Um, then these pillows are from the Studio McGee, also from Target. The pillow, also from Target, and it's from um, Threshold. Then the pillow sleeves, Casa Luna, from Target. My body pillow from Target, the cover also from Target. These um, pictures on top of our headboard, I got them, I don't know, probably like three years ago from Home Goods. And there's just these crystals, one's light blue, one's dark blue. I believe they were like $40 each, but I see stuff like this at Home Goods all the time. Then we have this bench. It's kind of like beat up and stuff because Mumble loves being here and he likes scratching. So you'll probably see that I have like a shaver somewhere here because I like trimming the edges that he scratches. But I got this bench from my mom and I think she got it from Marshalls for $100. This is our knockoff Hermes um, blanket, throw blanket. And I got it off of Amazon for $60. If I find the link, I'll link it down below. But I like it. It makes me feel bougie. Now moving on to my site. The same nightstand from Ikea. The same lamp. The box of tissues because I have horrible allergies in the morning. And then here I have a throw blanket just because I don't want it to like, you know, ruin the look of my bed. So I have it rolled up over here and I have some extra throw pillows that we don't use but I have nowhere to keep them. So that's their spot. I have the same basket, fill of junk, my underwears and bras, and then my socks. Moving on to this side, we have our closet. This is our closet. We share a closet. So my side goes all the way up to here. And then this little chunk is my husband's. I won't show you because it's really messy in there. But then, walking towards over here, we have our laundry um, bins. So this is darks, lights, and whites. And I got these felt um, hampers from Target. They're from the Bright Room collection. And then this came in handy. Like this was a must for my husband and I. We bought a little fridge so whenever I was pumping and like feeding Milena, we had all of her bottles ready to go. All my fresh milk needed to go in here. And that's why we still have the bottle warmer. But we actually have to put that away because she no longer takes a warm bottle at night. So we have a roller for me to roll out my body before I go to bed. I have all my hair clips. Oh, this is the shaver that I'm talking about. To get rid of those sh string fabrics. And then this is my laser machine. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Up on top of the refrigerator, we have like some of my jewelry, my husband's colognes, my perfumes. Honestly, we're not really cologne and perfume people, but it's nice to have some. I think half of these I stole from my mom and the other half my brother gives them to me for my birthday. But yeah, it's nice to have. Then I have some earrings that I don't know why I don't want to get rid of the box. And then, yeah, some more earrings, some rings, earrings, earrings, and my deodorant. But, yeah. Now, moving on to this wall, we got a TV in our room. We literally didn't have a TV in our room for years, years. And my husband always wanted a TV in our room. But, I don't know, I just don't feel that a TV belongs in our room because this is the time that we get to talk, you know our intimate time and I don't want any distractions with the TV but let me tell you this week that I have been sick when I had COVID I wished I had a TV and right now I'm not mad at the fact that we have a TV it's so nice like it's the ideal situation you know if you are the, the kind of people that eat in your room you can have like your food here you're chilling laying down watching the TV all in the comfort of your room doesn't that sound nice I do not eat in my room but I get two out of the three options I lay down and I watch some TV but yeah, I'm not mad at this whole TV situation, at least not in this house. When we move to our, you know, other house, then we might not have a TV. But yeah, guys, that completes. Oh, we have a window. 
that completes our room. These blinds, they're blackout curtains from um, Costco. And my mom hemmed them. And honestly, it's not that great of a job. But you know what? It is what it is. These probably will stay um, when we move or something. But yeah, guys. That concludes our video. I hope you got some inspiration. I hope you enjoyed my <laughs> minimal decor and you found this helpful. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Peace.